what's going on? Mystic Knight here, back again with another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Uh, we're back here today on uh, the vanilla game. Uh, just checking out some... I was working on some stuff the other night, actually. Working on uh, just some organization and stuff like that. Trying to get some of my inventory and my dinos cleaned up a little bit. Um, from doing all the killing and stuff I've done. Try to get some stuff put away. Um, so I figured I'd come back and we'll just do another video. Why not? Uh, plus, the other thing they added um, in the last update, well, a couple things they added. Uh, welcome, guys, back to Vanilla Ark. I uh, remember last episode, we came to this guy here. This guy right here that we're biting the Diplodocus. They're okay. I really don't have a use for them. Um, you know, in all honesty, I have zero use for it. Um, just, I mean, it don't do nothing. It's just a transport mount. That is all it is. It is strictly a dino transport. That's it. It does not attack. It does not do anything. Um, it's just strictly a dino transport. Uh, but they added this thing here. <clears throat> this indestructible training dummy. Uh, you know, yeah, it only has 400 health, but it's indestructible. You can't, you can't hurt it. You can hit it with whatever you want to hit it with, and it won't hurt it. So I thought we'd test out some of my dinos and see what their strength is. Right? So I was playing with it. Unfortunately, it does not read the fire attack. But I'm assuming the fire attack is the same amount of damage as the breathe, you know, the bite attack. Except for the fact that it adds the additional um, DOT effect, you know, the damage over time, the burn effect. Um, but if we take a bite, if we take a bite, you can see our damage is 302,000 per bite. Okay, that's pretty dang high. I mean, that is serious damage. Um, so if we bite it, it'll tell you the DPS, the damage per second. So our damage per second is 302,417. So it basically does one bite a second. Uh, you know, if you continue to bite, it does, you know, one bite a second, basically. Um, so I did some leveling on, uh, you know, on my Rexes, as you remember. This one here is max level. 1 million HP, 24,000 melee. Okay, that's pretty strong, right? Uh, yeah, no, my stuff's unpowered. I have my generator turned off because I'm just, I'm not using it. Um, 259k damage. So he has 24,000 melee. And this one here has 25,8. So a little bit more melee. So their melee is pretty close to the Rex melee. As far as base damage. Uh, but if we bite it a bunch of times, it'll tell me what my damage is. 311,506 is my damage per second. That's pretty good. That's a lot of damage. Uh, back up here. I would use the Brontos, but I'd have to move. Um, I would have to move my dummy. I'd have to create a new dummy. Um, because of the fact that, yeah, and there's poop all over the place over here, because these guys were fighting the Dota Rex and got wrecked. Uh, so yeah. Uh, let me take your saddle. Let me put the saddle on you. And as with an ascendant saddle on these guys, you know, the armor's 36, which is really not that great. Um, I'd really like a better saddle. Um, there's a lot of durability on it, but the armor's not that great, in all honesty. Um, so this guy here is 21,000 melee, 800,000 health. Okay? And these. This one is the female, this girl. She's a 1932 female. Okay. Let me get backed up here. Having to constantly poop. Alright, come on now. Turning radius is terrible. 
Alright, so 229 damage, which is expected. Because the damage, you know, the melee is lower. So that's, that's a lot of melee, though. Right? I thought I turned my generator off. I don't know. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Uh, this one here is super high level. Okay. This guy here is 1673. Almost 700,000 HP. 28,000 melee. 28,000. Okay. You ready for this? You ready? Boom. 253. Okay. That's not bad. What was the... What were these guys again? I forgot now. Let me go get the bigger one here. Put this back on you. We're going to do a comparison here. My dragon was 300, right? A little over 3. If I'm not mistaken, my dragon was a little over 300k. Ah, stop pooping. Nobody's got time for that. 259. Alright, it's basically 260 almost. Alright, so about 260. So we're at 253. Not bad. Watch this. 329. With the slash attack. 329. That's more than a Rex. Oh, I think I pooped or something on me. Hang on. Let's clear all this out. So I'm pretty sure their damage is based off of a Rex. For the, you know, the amount of base damage. Yeah, 395 with 28,000 melee. That is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. The amount of damage these guys can do. But that's what I was wanting to show you guys to start off with today, is just how much damage these guys can do. Okay. No, but, well, I guess not, because all my lights inside and stuff are on. Yeah. Okay. Um. Put them down. Are they good? They should be... They should be good. Let me actually take this one. Yeah. Egg health is perfect. Incubation is almost done. Oh, they better not spoil. I don't think it spoils. I don't think that... It, I don't think that works with the fertilized eggs. I don't think they actually spoil. Okay, let me pick this one up real quick. Imprint, except. Um, crap, I don't have any food. Uh, disable wandering. Crap, 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 crap. I don't have any food. What am I doing? I don't have any food on you either. I'm gonna, it's gonna die. Uh, give me just some regular meat. I'd give it prime, but regular meat will do for now. Oh, it died! Oh no, it's following me! Come here, buddy! Before you do die. Okay. Okay, we saved it. Come here! Come here, little buddy! Hey, come here. Oh, you're glitched into the house. No, it's too big. It's growing up too fast and it don't fit out of the house anymore. Well, just stay there. I'll have to ghost it out later in order to get it out. So we'll go ahead and put that on there. See, imprinting 0%, but it didn't require it because it grew up too fast. 
Okay, there we go. I didn't have to ghost it. Um, yeah, I really want to do that imprinting, but I don't know if there's a server setting you can change to adjust that timing. I'll have to look. Um, because that really sucks. And this guy needs to go somewhere where he's not eating on my food trucks. Because he's going to empty out my food trough. What do you have on you? You got a bunch of berries. So that's fine. You keep them. We'll give you... Well, I have more meat too, but we'll give you all that. That should get you going, man. Are you a boy or a girl? I don't even know. Uh, you're a girl. Cool. Alright. So, what else are we going to do today? Um, I don't know. I guess we can go work on the house some more. Because I really want to get my other base up and going. Um, oh, I know what I wanted to do. Um, there was a door I wanted to put on there. Wide. Uh, wide tall, wide door. Frame. Door. Okay, so let's go ahead and put all this back. And then we'll come in here, and the stupid spino. Boom! Use. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Now, they don't quite open and close as fast as a regular door. So that's kind of disappointing. Um, but that should work pretty much the same um, as like a dino gate. Because I'm pretty sure I can get these guys out of it. I'm like 100% sure I can get these guys out. Come on, turn around. Oh, you're encumbered. Why are you encumbered? Because I got a lot of crap on me. Let's go ahead and raise your weight to 500. So you're not slow. And I'm almost positive these guys will fit through a two by two. Oh yeah. No. Really? I figured they would. Okay, back up. I wonder... Um... Pick up... No, I want the... No, I want the frame. The door frame. There we go. Pick up. I tell you, a turning radius in these guys, man. No. Why is that a thing? Why can he not fit through a 2x2? Two two? That is more than enough space. That's just dumb. That's just dumb. He should fit through a 2x2 two two door. I'm just saying. That should should fit. There's no reason for it to not fit. Alright, come here. Well, that's a bust. I mean, I'll probably leave it anyways. Alright, guys, we're back. I found him. We're gonna come over here. I'm just gonna go, Hey, boys! How's it going, boys? And they're all dead. I think Ellie might must survive. Okay. We got them all. They're all dead. Look at Taking a nap. Primitive. I will take them. Yes, who's a big boy? Not you! 
Drag body. Drag body. Access inventory. Ooh, ascendant, ascendant. And mastercraft. Eh, I don't need that. Alright. Am I at full HP already? I am at full HP already. Alright, so what do we want? 200% movement. And by two, I mean three. 300. Melee will do five for right now. Okay, maybe not. Seriously, you guys want to go? You you really want to take on a dragon? You little Ankleos want to take on a dragon? I tell you, they'll never learn. Hey, buddy. 1,000 Tenoboa, dead. Go die in a fire. Oh, wait, you did. Ha <laughs> ha! Ooh, you must be pretty high level. 950. Fiumia! Die in a fire! Dilo! Die in a fire! I'll stomp on you! Alright. So, as I said, 5k and 45k. I'll tell you what, as long as we're on this one, let's do some leveling and then we'll go work on the house. Hey, boys, girls, what's going on? What's happening, man? What you doing? Oh, you think you can eat and heal? Ooh, he did some damage. Alright, raise that. I gotta get you away from them so you don't eat the bodies. No, 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 and no. <clears throat> Um, sure. No. Durability 74? Garbage. Garbage. Alright, you can continue to rock. Alright. Um. So what do we got now? We're almost next level. Alphas don't give much XP anymore because of the freaking dino nerf that they did. They reduced their XP, um, the amount of XP that they give by 45%, I think it was. Yeah. Hi, buddy. You want to play? Even though you're on fire? No? You want to put you out of your misery? Done. Where that raptor went. I don't think it said I killed the raptor. No, I didn't. Well, we'll let him clean up. Oh, you want to knock me back, huh? Oh, this must be a high level. 750. Alright. I need more melee. Melee's not enough. Bunch of terror birds. You wanna die? Oh, you do? Okay. Well, let, me, let me help you with that. Dragon assisted suicide. Is that a thing? Dragon assisted suicide. I guess that's what that is. Alright. Let's uh, head up to the North Island. Uh, and, uh, I'll bring you guys back if I find anything when I, in between there. Alright guys, we're back. Um, I just killed that Carno because I wanted to get this drop. So I thought I'd bring you guys back to open it. And then there's a bunch of Rexes and stuff up there. We'll go see what they got. Seriously, red blueprint and that's what's in it. Garbage. 
Let me out of my dragon. Um. Let's just kill all of the things. Ooh, that's a 1500 Karno in there. 1050 Rex. <laughs> Oops. I'm taking a 1050 Rex, dude. 1400? Uh, I'm going to try to knock that one out. Payment. I don't have my kibble with me. Shoot. Kill everything in the area. Hi, buddy. I'm over here now. Come on, reload. No, 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 no. Let him go heal, because that did a lot of damage. I did not mean to do that. There's plenty of corpses for him to eat. Alright. Let him eat. Come here, buddy. Hey, I'm right here. Oh. There. Alright, let him eat. I'm gonna go get the kibble I need for him, and I'll be right back, guys. Well, guys, we lost it. I just got back here, and there was two Carnos attacking it, and it wouldn't eat, and they killed it. Makes me very sad. Because I really wanted it. Um, 11.50 saver wouldn't have been too bad. Alright, we're going to bring melee to 10k, and then we're going to work some more on health, I think. I think... Did I see a dragon over here or no? No. Sometimes there is a dragon around the backside here. Get off of me! You don't get the right to bite me. Alright. Anybody else want to go? No? Alright. Well, I'm going to work on leveling this girl up a little bit more. And uh, I'll bring you guys back in a minute. <clears throat> guys, look. Look what I found. It's only 600. Oh, my eye itches. Uh, but look at it. It's like all black. It's all black. With like gray wingtips. It's so cool. It's just prime taming it. I didn't have the kibble on me for an RG. Um, I don't even remember what RG kibble is now off the top of my head. Um, I really don't. Uh, but look at it. It's so cool looking. It's so cool. It's like all black and gray. Oh, I didn't mean to fall. Dang it. Okay, we can get back up there. Look at Look at it. Got little black feet and everything. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, it's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love it. All right, we're going to let it tame. All right, guys, I'm back. And I have bad news. I don't know what happened to my bird. I literally have spent like the last 10 minutes or better circling this island trying to find it. I swear, I swear, I swear, I swear, I saw it, that it had tamed out. Uh, I might have killed it. I don't know. Uh, but I know I looked at it, and it had, like, one bite left when I walked away from it. Um, and I'm pretty sure I didn't kill anything else in the area. So, but I'm done. I've got a bunch of levels I haven't spent here. Health's at 500. Uh, we're going to pump a bunch of melee on this one. Uh, so there, 1600. Wait, I'll probably pump a little bit, maybe. Probably not. 
I probably won't use this one as a weight bird. Um, because I don't need it. I have my other dragons that are weight dragons. It's got like 100,000 weight on it. Um, so I'll probably pump this to at least a million health. Um, and then we'll go from there with melee. Uh, but I'm going to meet you guys back at, um, did something want to bite me? Huh? Something mad at me? No? I don't know what it was. Uh, I'm going to meet you guys back at my southern house once I switch dragons. So I will be back in a minute. Once you know, guys, I come home and there's a diver outside my base. I think, awesome, another one to tame. Look at this level. Ready? Freaking level 50. Stupid game. Teasing me like that. How dare it. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked. Get wrecked! It just got killed by the electric fence. Alright, park this guy over here. This girl, sorry, this girl. Um, it still makes me bad about the imprinting. I'm gonna look that up and see um, if there's a server setting I can change to uh, enable that or you know change the, the timing on that. Oh, I forgot you were following me. No, stay. Alright, so I'm going to meet you guys back at my new house. And we'll be back when you guys are back. Uh, I am going to work on some of this. Uh, get the ceiling on here. Uh, I'm going to have to make up a bunch more ceilings. Because obviously I don't have nowhere near. Alright, can we make that jump? Yes. Okay. Let me get some more of this worked out, and I'll bring you guys back in just a minute. Okay, guys, we're back. Um, put them away, put them away. I've gone through... I don't even know how many ceilings. Um, I, I It's done. But I'm for certain there's at least 400 ceilings up here. Um... Go away. Um, yeah, I would guess there's probably around the 400 mark. That many. And it sucks. Um, what I wanted to do now, I got all these foundations that I have no use for. Uh, what I wanted to do now was what? What was I doing? Oh, paint, 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 paint. Um, ba -dum -bum -bum. I thought I grabbed the red. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, waste that white. I don't know what color was in it, actually. Six. Um. Yeah. Two, three, four, five, six. Enable it all. Okay, and paint. Aha! Ah! Back up. Run of paint. Okay. Not that ain't what I wanted. Dang it. Did hit control. We'll do it this way and see if we get more ceilings painted. I have a feeling we probably will. Oops, I missed one. I don't know why it didn't paint that one. It double painted on me. Why are you double painting? Stop it! Um, some of this does look wonky, but it's the best I could do. Uh, even with the no collision, what happens is it gets too far, um, inside the ground, and then it just says you can't place a structure here. Um, because it's not only supposed, you know, according to arc build mechanics, you know, not only is it supposed to be obstructed, it's not supposed to be able to be built there, period. So... 
Yeah. Oh wow, yeah, you get a lot more doing it one at a time. Alright guys, we're back. And that is it, man. It is painted and we are done. Um, I'm gonna do something on the top here. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what. Um, I had an idea, but since this isn't actually square, um, I don't know how it'll work out. Um, I might try it anyways and just try to um, like come back to, to this tile right here. This one right here that I'm biting. Uh, is it this one? No. No, back up, back up. Yeah, this one right here. That my head's on, right below my head. Come to this one, and then probably. No. Is it this one or something? I'll try to square it off. Uh, and I have, I'm going to put a greenhouse up here, I think. Um, somebody's on the back, I can honestly get rid of, but, um, I could have built it taller, I guess. Um, so that way these didn't clip and it was completely square. Um. You know, I, I don't know. Um, man, I just, I hate to tear all that out. Uh, well, I mean, tearing it out wouldn't be a big deal. I could just break these and look across the front here and take these pillars out. Um, and it would collapse. Um, you know, that's all I have to do to get rid of it, but it would be rebuilding it. It took me all day to rebuild that. That's like 400 ceilings. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, I apologize for that abrupt cut there. Uh, I had to, to sneeze, so, so I had to do an abrupt cut. Um, but uh, I did do a couple of things as long as I was offline. I, you know, I, I had the recording paused. I did go ahead and do a couple things. Uh, I went ahead and changed the color on my dragon and made him all black. Um, just because I thought it looked really cool. I was playing around with the paint on the Tranodon. Uh, I painted him black and blue, and it looks pretty cool. Uh, and then uh, I also added... Um, okay, it took me out of cane mode. I also added the double doors, so I can get in and out of the base. Um, so, yeah, I went ahead and added those. Um, so you can see, you know, I've got the door here, the black and red, or... Just like that one. And you come over here, I've got this one that's black and red. Um, so I had to figure out, I think I want to put an elevator back here somewhere. Um, is my idea uh, to get up top. Um, that's my ideal spot for it. Um, it's somewhere along this back, probably like right here. Uh, to get up and down from up there um, If I wanted to put somebody up top and I wanted to get up there. I mean, it's not a big deal uh, to get up there uh, You know, I can run around um, and I can get up there maybe maybe not <laughs> Maybe you can't get that way. Maybe you do have to go all the way around. I thought maybe I could get that way um I had to... Ah, that's gonna hurt. Oh, I hit the water. Woo! Um... Yeah, I mean, that's definitely gonna be a better option. Um... To get around all of these rocks. Uh, I mean, every one of these I think is breakable. So, I mean, really, if I needed stone, I could break all of these. Um... I mean, in all honesty, I could put... Uh, pillars, just random places, and clear this entire place and have it completely empty. Um, which would be kind of cool to see this island just completely emptied. Um, you know, I mean, it would suck in a way because I'd lose all this metal. But, yeah. What about you? I don't know, I have my thing turned off. 
What are you? Oh, you're a 1300. Cool. Uh, what level are you? 950. Dang, there's some big dinos on here. Um, I do have to be careful on my other series that I've got going on. Um, my Anunnaki series. I have to be careful on this. Well, I'm not on this particular map. Um, but if I was to do Anunnaki on this map, um, I'd have to be extremely cautious and probably remove all spawns from this island by placing uh, pillars everywhere. Um, mostly down here along the beaches um, because of the Dota Cure Sporten spawns in this island. Um, ooh, Bronto Egg. Is there Bronto mad at me? Really? Okay. I know, I need to turn off Blade Shafts and Bloom quality. But, uh, I'm just gonna get back around to the front here, guys. Uh... Get out of here! Yeah, get back around to the front, yeah. Maybe next episode, uh, we'll try to go on the hunt again for that Alpha Mosasaur. Uh, cause I really want to find it. I don't want to wreck its face. Um, I could bring my dinos down here, but I don't know how far in they'll fit. Um, and it's quicker for me to fly up there. And they're safe where they're at. I mean, nothing bothers them. Um, uh, why did I come in that door? I have no idea. Uh, but anyways, guys, again, I apologize for that abrupt cut. But that is going to do it for tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Uh, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button for me. If you're new, welcome. Hope you guys are enjoying the content. Do subscribe. I do daily videos. And as always, guys, thank you so much for being here. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, everybody. What's going on? Mystic Nine here. Back again with another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Uh, we're back here today on uh, the vanilla game. Uh, just checking out some... I was working on some stuff the other night, actually. Working on... Uh, just some organization and stuff like that. Trying to get some of my inventory and my dinos cleaned up a little bit. Um, from doing all the killing and stuff I've done. Try to get some stuff put away. Um, so I figured I'd come back and we'll just do another video. Why not? Uh, plus the other thing they added, um, in the last update. Well, a couple things they add. Uh, welcome guys back to Vanilla Ark. I uh, remember last episode we came to this guy here. This guy right here that we're biting the Diplodocus. They're okay. I really don't have a use for them. Um, you know, in all honesty, I have zero use for it. Um, just, I mean, it don't do nothing. It's just a transport mount. That is all it is. It is strictly a dino transport. That's it. It does not attack. It does not do anything. Um... It's just strictly a dino transport. Uh, but they added this thing here. <clears throat> this indestructible training dummy. Uh, you know, yeah, it only has 400 health, but it's indestructible. You can't, you can't hurt it. You can hit it with whatever you want to hit it with. I'm not using it. Um, 259k damage. So he has 24,000 melee. And this one here has 25-8. So a little bit more melee. So their melee is pretty close to the Rex melee. As far as base damage. Uh, but if we bite it a bunch of times, it'll tell me what my damage is. 311-506 is my damage per second. That's pretty good. That's a lot of damage. Uh, back up here. I would use the Brontos, but I'd have to move... Um, I would have to move my dummy. I had to create a new dummy. Um, because of the fact that, yeah, and there's poop all over the place over here. Because these guys were fighting the Dota Rex and got wrecked. Uh, so yeah. Uh, let me take your saddle. Put the saddle on you. 
And as with the Ascendant Saddle on these guys, you know, the armor's 36, which is really not that great. Um, I'd really like a better saddle. Um, there's a lot of dirt, and it won't hurt it. So I thought we'd test out some of my dinos and see what their strength is. Right? So I was playing with it. Unfortunately, it does not read the fire attack. But I'm assuming... The fire attack is the same amount of damage as the breathe, you know, the bite attack, except for the fact that it adds the additional um, DOT effect, you know, the damage over time, the burn effect. Um, but if we take a bite, if we take a bite, you can see our damage is 302,000 per bite. Okay, that's pretty dang high. I mean, that is serious damage. Um, so if we bite it, it'll tell you the DPS, the damage per second. So our damage per second is 302,417. So it basically does one bite a second. Uh, you know, if you continue to bite, it does, you know, one bite a second, basically. Um, so I did some leveling on, uh, you know, on my Rexes, as you remember. This one here... Is max level. 1 million HP, 24,000 melee. Okay? That's pretty strong, right? Uh, yeah, no, my stuff's unpowered. I had my generator turned off because I'm durability on it, but the armor's not that great, in all honesty. Um, so this guy here is 21,000 melee, 800,000 health. Okay? And these, this one is the female, this girl. She's a 1932 female. Okay. Let me get backed up here. Having to constantly poop. Alright, come on now. Turning radius is terrible. Alright, so 229 damage, which is expected. Because the damage, you know, the melee is lower. So that's, that's a lot of melee, though. Right? I thought I turned my generator off. I don't know. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Uh, this one here is super high level. Okay? This guy here is 1673. Almost 700,000 HP. 28,000 melee. 28,000! Okay? You ready for this? You ready? Boom! 253. Okay, that's not bad. What were them? What were these guys again? I forgot now. Let me go get the bigger one here. Put this back on you. We're gonna do a comparison here. My dragon was 300, right? A little over three. If I'm not mistaken, my dragon was a little over 300k. Ah, stop pooping. Nobody's got time for that. 259. Alright, it's basically 260 almost. Alright, so about 260. So we're at 253. Not bad. Watch this. 329. With the slash attack. 329. That's more than a Rex. Oh, I think I pooped or something on me. Hang on. Let's clear all this out. So I'm pretty sure their damage is based off of a Rex. For the, you know, the amount of base damage. Yeah, 395 with 28,000 melee. That is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. The amount of damage these guys can do. But that's what I was wanting to show you guys to start off with today. Is just how much damage these guys can do.